Hi, hello, welcome back again in our math class. This is Teacher Guabo, your math teacher. So that's my name, Teacher Guabo. Okay, for today's lesson is about number patterns. We all know that our previous lesson is about ordering numbers. And if you haven't seen yet our previous video, you can search in my YouTube channel, Teacher Guapo. Okay, now let's start. Our topic for today is about number patterns. Now, in number patterns, what patterns do you see in here? As you can see here, you can see negative 2, negative 2, or let's say minus 2, minus 2. But let me ask you, what is number patterns? Now, number pattern, in mathematics, number patterns are the patterns in which a least number that follows a certain sequence. Again, in mathematics, number patterns are the patterns in which a list of number that follows a certain sequence. Now, example of number patterns. Pattern of 3. As you can see here, you can see a number line. We call it number lines. So you can see 0, 3, 6, 9. And then you can see it's counting forward or increasing. So from left to right, the next number is obtained by adding 3. This is the left side going there to the right side. So left to right, that is plus 3. That's and the next number here is number 15. And from right to left, the next number is obtained by subtracting 3 or minus 3. As you can see here, minus 3. So note that in this pattern, the difference between any two consecutive number is 3. So only the difference is number 3. Okay, here, another example. The pattern here or the number of patterns here is pattern of 4. As you can see here, from left to right, or from right to left, you can see here is obtained by adding 3 and subtracting 3, plus 4 or minus 4, adding 4 or subtracting 4. Note that in this pattern, the difference between any two consecutive numbers is 4, plus 4 and minus 4. And here, the next pattern is pattern of 5. So that's plus 5. From left to right, that is plus 5. And from right to left, it is minus 5. So the same thing. The pattern here is consecutive number is 5. Okay, another example here. There is the pattern of 5. Here, from left to right, the next number is obtaining by adding 25 or plus 25. And here, the other one here is, from right to left is subtracting 25 or minus 25. Okay, now here, it's pattern of 50. As you can see here, from left to right, or from right to left, it is plus 50 or minus 50, or we call it subtracting 50. Okay. Now let's try to recognize the increasing pattern and fill in the blanks. What do you think is the pattern here? Start from 345. So 345 to 360, how many or how much did you add in here? Is it add or subtract? Always remember, if the word is increasing, that means you have to add plus. Okay, Add means to have to plus. So how much? So 360 to 375, 375 to 390, 390 to 405. It is increases by 15. So this plus 15, another plus 15, another plus 15, and plus 15. So it is increases by 15. How about in letter B? It is increases by, what do you think? From 317, to 327, to 737, to 747, to 757. It is increases by, okay, it increases by 10. That is plus 10, 
plus 10, plus 10, and plus 10. That is increasing, okay? Increasing, increases by 10, increases by 15, plus 15, plus 10. Now here, let us recognize the decreasing pattern and fill in the blank, okay? Let us recognize. Now in letter A, from 340, 340 to 330, what do you think is the pattern here? What do you think? It is decreases or minus by 10, decreases by 10. So 340 minus 10 is 330. And 330 minus 10 is 320. 320 minus 10 is 310. And 310 minus 10 is 300. Now in letter B here, 990. And the next number, as you can see here, is 890. So 990 to 890, that is minus, what do you think? And from 890 to 790, how much? So it is decreases by 100, okay? So that is minus 100, so become 890. 890 minus 10 is 790. And from 790 minus 100, it's equal to 690. And from 690 to 590, it is, let's see it. Okay, it's minus 100. So just here, as you can see here, 9 become 8, become 7, become 6, become 5. Okay, so that's how to change it. Now let's try this one. Okay, let's try this. Now from 320 to 330, what do you think in here? Is it plus or minus? Okay, we will recognize the pattern and then we will fill in the missing numbers now from 330 from 330 to the next box that is plus 10 so 330 plus 10 is equals to 340 now from 340 to the next box the same we will add 10 or plus 10 so 340 plus 10 is equals to 350 that's very easy now thank you so much for listening and see you next time bye thanks for watching